first mate, and Captain Marley. They buried their treasure along with plenty of booby traps on a place believed to be called Inky Island. They made a map which they divided into four pieces, each man taking one. Raph Scallion later opened the Steam and Weenie Hut on Scab Island. It was a huge success, but fell into disrepair after Raph was killed in a flash fire. Young Lindy drifted aimlessly, down on his luck until he mysteriously came into money while panhandling on Booty Island. He used the cash to bankroll an advertising firm which failed after its gross mishandling of the gangrene and honey account. Mr. Rogers retired off the coast of Fat Island. He marketed homemade contest grog brewed in a bathtub until his recent disappearance. Captain Marley vanished while sailing in the America's Cup race. His boat was leaning at the time. Great shipwrecks of our century. It says here the Mad Monkey sank at 33 North, 89 West. The Joy of Hex. I think it's meant for advanced voodoo practitioners. The writing's way too technical for me. Excuse me, aren't you Guybrush Threepwood? No, my name is Kate Capsize. You must have me confused with someone else. Kate, eh? That's an unusual name. Perhaps you have some identification. My ID is on my ship. Wait here while I go and get it. Nice try, Guybrush. I don't know how you got out of the jail, but I'm taking you back in. You can't go up there! Hey, aren't you supposed to be in jail? You must be confusing me with my cousin, Guybrush. Oh, I see. The resemblance is uncanny. Can I go upstairs? I'm sorry, but the governor doesn't want to be disturbed while he's eating. When will the governor be finished eating? <laughs> Look behind you! A three-headed monkey! Really? I'd better fetch the cook. Famous pirate quotations. Happiness is a warm manatee. Old skunk eye. Kiss me, I've got scurvy. Fester leech. Darn! Commander Buttonhead. Violets are blue, roses are red, we're coming aboard. Prepare to eat lead. Rap scallion. Mouthwash. We don't need no stinking mouthwash. Barney Gout. you want to go
I think I'd better make myself scarce instead. Where do you want to go? Where do you want to go? Well, well, well. I knew you'd come back. My customers always do, eventually. I'm looking for a good used coffin. Amazing! When you first walked in here, I said, now there's a guy who needs a good used coffin. There happens to be an excellent deal right behind you. Let's go take a look-see. Now this here is the Cadillac of coffins. Look at all that leg room. There's room in there for Long John Silver himself. Here, let me get in and show you. Yes, a man can really rest in peace and comfort with one of these. Can I show you anything else? Could you show me that coffin again? Heck, why not? Why should a man's coffin be any smaller than his bunk at sea? Sure, sure, try out the lid operation. It's just as roomy clothes. Can I show you anything else? Could you show me that coffin again? Sure! I could spend a lot of time in a coffin like this. Can I show you anything else? Could you show me that coffin again? I was just going to suggest that myself. Look at how freely I can wiggle my toes. This thing's bigger than my kitchen. But it's open. It's just as roomy closed. Here, let me show you. See? You know, a person's coffin should reflect their station life. If you're thinking about one of those cheaper models, first ask yourself, isn't my loved one worth the best? I hear you knocking up there. That's solid oak you're hearing. Yes, it sure is nice in here. Uh, be there in a minute. Hey, I think the lid's stuck. Uh, be there in a minute. Uh, be there in a minute. Uh, excuse me, friend. Could you see if the clasp is closed on this thing? Are you still out there? Hello? Where do you want to go? Stan's Cozy Crypt, a place to spend eternity, not a fortune. Stan's Cozy Crypt, a place to spend eternity, not a fortune.
It's inscribed with a quote. Violets are blue, roses are red, we're coming aboard. Prepare to eat lead. Violets are blue, roses are red. Hmm. Ooh, looks like human ashes. Silty. Golden Tongue, the five-day treatment plan that helps you talk to women. Skink Toes. O de Mojo, the mystical aroma of voodoo captured in a delightful potpourri. Tender Touch Pirate Powder, prevents stump chafing and eye patch rash. Spider Lungs. Fruit Cocktail, in heavy syrup. Ash to Life, the uncremating cream. Hey! That's just a display model. I've got the real stuff back here. That's one of my most powerful potions. Brings the dead back to life. I could do lots of cool stuff with that. There are some complications. It only works on ashes, and the resurrection is only temporary. Plus, you need to bring me a sample of the subject's ashes before I can mix you up a batch. I have the ashes of somebody I'd like resurrected right here. Bring them to me. Now, there's only one small problem. I forgot the recipe. What? It's been a long time. I don't have that cookbook anymore. I've got a book of voodoo recipes. Good. How many crab scalps does it say to use? Thirteen. Good. That's just what I thought when I whipped up this experimental batch. Thanks. Remember, just a dabble do ya. <laughs> 